It's the morning time, and it's time to leave. We're going to Death Valley today. It's going to be hotter than balls outside. I hope we survive Death Valley. I hear a lot of people die at Death Valley. Die? Why do you think they call it Death Valley? I think it's just because it's hot in a desert. Feed the good. But we have a ton of water, so we'll be fine. And air. Death Valley is a We have a ton of water, so we'll be fine. And air conditioning. That's the key right there. Isn't it, Dan? It is. Oh, yeah. We're in the desert now, and the temperature keeps climbing. I will not be happy until it hits 110. We are at 102 right now. Yay! Yay! Can't wait. It's nice and cool in here. We got the air conditioning on. Ooh, it's nice. I don't want to go outside. <laughs> You're in your little cocoon in here. It's 104 now. Yep, and we just got ass raped for fuel. Uh, how much was it? It was three dollars and forty-five cents. Yes. Yep. It's fantastic. The truck over there has a snow plow on it. But here's the thing: I don't think he plows snow. I think he plows sand off the roads. What do you think? I'm hoping. You think that's a good guess? I get. Yeah. I mean, I don't know what else he would plow. Stones? Stones? Yeah, I guess stones too, but maybe, I mean... Maybe plows heat off the road. Plows heat off the road, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Alright, so we're gonna have some food. We're cooking burgers and we're having them on some Panera Bread bagels. That's gonna be great. I was just gonna throw the burgers on the pavement. <laughs> yeah, you could do that. They I mean, might leave them there for 10 minutes. They'll be just as hot as out of the pan. Oh, yeah. This is the Mojave. This is the Mojave Desert, right? Right guys? Mojave Desert, yes. And it's hot like the Mojave Desert. Yes. And it's dry like the Mojave really? Desert. Really? Yeah, that's, that's surprising. That tipped me off that it was the Mojave Desert. Okay. My keen sense. Yeah, I was, I was confused, you know, I, I, I wasn't sure. Yes. So. Turn around, mister. He's all mad. Why are you mad, Dad? Because we drove all the way out here and this place is closed. The it visitor right center. right on the radio that it was open every day of the week. So we drove through 106 degree temperature to get here, and it's closed. That's great, isn't it? And we needed information about camping and everything. Nope. No pamphlets or anything. Not a single one. Another thing that really grinds my gears is they water the grass out here. They're complaining, oh, we're in a drought. Oh, we don't have any water. But you're watering your grass. Come on, man. Come on, it's a desert. Plant some desert stuff. Come on. Here's something you never see. These are uh, solar power plants over there. But instead of uh, being solar panels, they have a bunch of mirrors on the ground which reflect the sunlight to, uh, to the central towers. And uh, those towers superheat uh, and liquefy salt, which is used to boil water and spin a turbine to create power. And then also, over there, there are a huge solar farm. I mean, that is a gigantic solar farm. This place is amazing. We're in Las Vegas. And what's the temperature, guys? 109. 109 degrees, almost to where we wanted to be today. 110. One degree off. We hit it. We shot right on past it and yep. now it's 111. 111 degrees. Man, this window feels like it's gonna catch on fire. <laughs> no, it's actually gonna melt. Yeah, it's melt right Man, there. it's hot. Oh my God. It's 113 now. This is about to top our hottest, the hottest climate we've ever been in, yes. or the hottest weather. Because yes. what was 114? 15. 115. Yep. So we have two more degrees. 115. And then we'll be there. So let's see if we can get there. 
Got our hotel already in Las Vegas, right down the street from the strip. Are the keys working? There it goes. Yeah, yeah I've got it. I didn't. And so we're gonna hang out here because it's hotter than balls outside. Hotter than balls outside. We're gonna hang out here maybe until it gets a little darker outside. It's only like four o'clock, right? It's not not that no, late. Yeah, almost five now. Almost five, really. Okay. And then we're gonna go walk around outside. We're headed towards the strip. And that sun is hot. <laughs> it's food time. They got like the best Chinese you could ever get. Panda Express. On this trip we passed probably every mom and pop Chinese restaurant you could think of in San Francisco and Seattle and I mean Los everywhere. Angeles, everywhere we've seen them. And did we stop at any of them? No. no. So we stopped at a Panda Express. So we come to Las Vegas and I'm sure there's probably good Chinese here somewhere but not right where we're at. No, definitely not. And the camera is just not wanting to focus on your head. It just, maybe because it's so sweaty. Uh, maybe. <laughs> maybe the, maybe it's glistening. Because everything, really glistening everything in the back is in focus, <laughs> except for your head. But I don't like Chinese, so I got some Popeyes chicken. That's right. Oh, by the way, anyways, you probably noticed, but that is like the biggest drink <laughs> I've ever seen. It's the size of my face, the size of my head. I mean, here's, here's <laughs> mine. <laughs> Almost a straw it as looks like the a top. micro mini, and that's a normal <laughs> sized drink, but now it looks so tiny. This thing weighs probably, I don't know, two pounds, I would imagine. That's probably. ridiculous, man. Are ridiculous. Yeah. It's and just like hold on, hold on. Thing. Look, just take a look at this Starbucks coffee down there. Look at that thing. And you have that weird thing over there. And man, and Starbucks has got it locked up, dude. Because there is no other coffee shop here other than Starbucks. Yep. They got locked up every oh, casino. Every street corner, every casino, it's a Starbucks. We have little water tornadoes. They go, they go up and down. Look at that thing. They're even in the floor as well. So they rise up and down. Yeah. One of them. A really tall one. From a childhood perspective here, if I was a kid and came here, it would have been over. I mean, because you can look right down these things. Look at that. That is crazy. So we're at a coffee shop in uh, Las Vegas. Yeah, and what we said that Starbucks had locked up, well, obviously, we were mistaken because we're at this place. What is it? Samba Latte. It's a coffee tasting bar. Ooh. It's Las Vegas number one coffee. Right. Ooh. Supposedly. And what's even better is it's like arctic cold in here it's oh yeah like right in front of the fan and there's nobody here so oh yeah the environment's great yeah. Okay. Yeah, and we're on a couch <laughs> and on the couch as well yeah. well that's an iced coffee so you can't get a true representation yeah that's good good mm -hmm. sweet 